The harsh cold climate and dry indoor air during winter can leave the skin in less than ideal shape. Today I will be sharing several tips for the winter skincare and from what to do from the inside out. So you can keep your skin healthy, moisturized and looking good all season long. Cold air, dry indoor heat, low humidity levels and harsh winter winds can all zap your skin off moisture. This can leave your skin looking a lot less radiant than normal. Not only your face, but also your hands, feet, and all the areas exposed to the elements. Now, some of the most common signs and symptoms of dry dehydrated skin includes, and I'm sure that you know these ones, flakiness, scaliness, redness, roughness, itchiness, feeling of raw, irritated skin, cracks in your skin, stinging or burning. They don't feel good. So very quickly, if this is your first time on my channel, my name is Maria and welcome to Aglai Aesthetics Online. I am an aesthetics instructor and examiner for many years. So I've seen a lot of things come and go and what works. I have an online aesthetics training for individuals to become certified aestheticians or for personal knowledge. Give me comments below, love to connect with you. So let's get started. Let's take a, a closer look at several tips that may help you boost the health of your skin during the colder months of the year. Number one, and I'm sure you're doing this, moisturize right away after washing. Anytime you wash your face, hands, or your body, you strip your natural oils. Since these oils help to lock in the moisture, it is vital to replace them right away. Number two, use overnight treatments are excellent way to revitalize your skin and to prevent dry skin. Emollients are great for moisturizing. However, because they are heavier type of cream, it can take longer to penetrate in the skin and to be absorbed. By applying an emollient to your skin overnight, your skin will have the time it needs to absorb the treatment and for the emollient to replenish your skin with the moisturizing uh, ingredients and oils that it needs. Now, a ceramide based product would be helpful because the wind strips your skin and the wind against your skin is a, a mechanical way to remove your top layer. You will want to prevent moisture from leaving your skin by the way of transepidermal water loss. Ultimately, dehydrates your skin. So you Number three, adjust your skincare routine. If your skin feels especially sensitive or irritated due to the winter air, you may want to consider to simplify your skincare routine. Keep in mind that your skin's moisture barrier needs to be healthy in order to respond well to serums, toners, um, scrubs, acids, or other types of beauty treatments. Try keeping your skincare routine simple. Consider using in the morning a moisturizer and uh, a mineral sunscreen in the morning and a gentle cleanser pH balance with a good maybe NRF2 moisturizer at night. Once you feel that your skin moisture barrier is back to being healthy, you slowly can add acids like HAs or BHAs or mild scrubs to your skincare routine. Number four, and this is important, use a humidifier. It helps to bring moisture into the air of your surroundings which can especially be helpful in the indoor, if you have indoor heating is, and if the heat is really up high in the winter months. Having moisture in the air can act as a natural moisturizing agent, which in turn may prevent and relieve skin dryness. 
and replenish moisture in the top of the layer of your skin. Number five, dial down the temperature both in your environment and also in the shower or bath. At the end of the day, cold day, you going into a hot shower is very soothing. I understand. But to keep your skin nourished, you want to keep your water temperature closer to lukewarm. Hot water can strip away your skin natural oils faster than lukewarm water and possibly even cause damage. Number six, go easy on exfoliants and scrubs, which helps remove the dead skin cells on the surface of your skin, can help keep your skin looking, yes, smooth and vibrant, but it's possible to over exfoliate your skin if you do it too often and also the wrong products. In the description box, I will have several other tutorials for you to look at and to review them. If your skin looks dry or flaky, you may want to opt for a gentle chemical exfoliant rather than a physical scrub. Harsher scrubs with large particles may be more likely to break down your skin moisture barrier and cause damage. If your skin is cracked, irritated or feeling raw and itchy, it may be best to avoid exfoliation of any kind until your skin has healed. Number seven, try to add occlusive to your routine. Using emollients to help soothe and repair your skin barrier. But if you find that emollients ingredients aren't doing enough to heal your dry skin, you may want to consider incorporating occlusive ingredients into your skincare routine. Occlusive ingredients provide a physical barrier to lock in moisture into your skin. Example of occlusive ingredients includes uh, shea butter, cocoa butter, rosehip oil, oh I love that, jojoba oil. The best way to work these products into your routine is to apply them once or twice a day after moisturizing. So what I like to do on my skin is to apply a, an NRF2 moisturizer which repairs the skin from within and then I apply an, I, an oil light layer of oil on top of it and that becomes like an occlusive so it pushes my products in deeper into the skin number eight hydrate from the inside yes another way to keep your skin healthy and glowing is to make sure you are staying well hydrated throughout the day Number nine, opt for non-irritating fabrics. A good rule when dealing with any skin problems is to avoid wearing harsh materials or synthetics. If the skin on your body is extra dry, try to wear loose clothing, comfortable natural fabrics like cotton to reduce the risk of extra physical irritation. Looking for detergents formulated for sensitive skin with uh, no fragrance, which will likely be free of harsh chemicals. Number 10, wear gloves. Gloves are the ultimate physical barrier against environmental agents that can dry out your skin on your hands. So if you're doing the dishes or doing any cleaning, wear those rubber gloves. To protect your ears and head, wear a toque uh, or a hat, those ear muffs. Uh, if you're outside on the bitter cold day, cover your face with a scarf or a face mask. This warms the air you breathe in and helps prevent frostbite or dehydration of your nose and face. Eating certain healthy foods and applying good products, it will give your skin a smooth, rosy glow no matter 
how cold it gets. Drinking 8 to 10 glasses of water and herbal teas per day can help flush out toxins, prevent the skin from drying out, increase cellular turnover, and keep your skin young and fresh. Herbal teas are a great way to stay hydrated or you can choose a, a variety of green teas to help reduce inflammation. Eat one orange veggies such as carrots, squash, pumpkin, and sweet potatoes are full of carotenoids. Carotenoids increase our defense against the sun and damage from UV rays. Remember, it is important to always use a, a mineral sunscreen for protection, even in the winter. Green foods such as kale, spinach, full of vitamin C, which can act as your food equivalent of fountain of youth. Vitamin C helps to repair the skin by building collagen and help to ward off those pesky wrinkles. Eat at least one orange and one green food every day and your skin will thank you. Snack on healthy fat found in salmon, avocado, and chia seeds. These foods contain omega-3 fatty acids which aid in heart health and weight loss. But did you know they also give you healthy skin? They help reduce inflammation and prevent collagen breakdown. Less wrinkles. Eat at least one colorful fruit every day. Fruits such as blueberry, blackberries, cranberries are rich in antioxidants and antioxidants not only fight damaging free radicals in your body, they also fight those winter skin blues too. Antioxidants help protect your skin against damage caused by the sun and harsh weather conditions in the winter. And of course, I always add, take your NRF2 internally. It will help to produce your own antioxidants. All that information is down below. Blueberries have the added benefits of containing compounds that slow wrinkles and effects of aging. Think of antioxidants as your youth elixir, keeping you beautiful, ageless, and energized. An apple a day keeps a doctor away and also keeps those wrinkles at bay. Healthy eating, healthy skin, healthy you. Yes, what you do the, on the outside, it's important, but it's more important what you do internally. Let me know below if you have any further questions or what do you do for the winter. If you have not subscribed yet, please consider it. Give me a like, click the notification bell so you will not miss any of my educational tutorials. I hope that you found this video to be useful and walk away with simple and easy tips. Remember to share this information with your loved ones and treat yourself with love and respect. Until the next time, take care.